Had a little kitchen fire in the middle of the night. Landlord problems. So everybody, that video and the pictures you just saw are one of my rental properties. It is a house me and my partner own. That is just to show you that rental property ownership is not all just collecting money. I know I've shown you videos in the past, but I just want to reiterate, if you're looking to get into the rental property business, you will have unexpected repairs pop up. For instance, that fire happened last night at 9.44 p.m. At 9.44 p.m., my phone was ringing and I had to you know, put it together, on a, a, pro, a plan to action to figure it out, how to uh, fix that property. So we went over there today and I took a look at it and I was like, hey, you know, this is how we're gonna fix it. We're gonna get a new stove. We're gonna take the old vent hood slash microwave out. We're gonna put a new vent hood in. We're gonna get all that stuff remediated out. We're gonna repaint all those cabinets. Luckily though, you know, this is what I'm most thankful about. You know, aside from it not doing an awful lot of damage, it didn't hurt any of my tenants. No one got sick from lung, from my lung getting too much smoke in there or any, um, or, or died, fortunately. You know, so fortunately, this problem is a pretty minor problem in the grand scheme of things. And, and you will have problems like this pop up. It is not just you got to get the, law, the lawns cut and tenants moving out. But you got to fix things. You know, it's also when tenants live in a house, you have to fix things as well. And this is one of those unexpected issues that pop Anyways, I hope you have a great Saturday. And if you're looking to get some rental properties, give me a call.